couple more creepy creations on Friday night on two with a Hammer Horror double bill featuring the two top names in the frightening film business, Peter Cushing and Christopher Lee. At five past ten, The Curse of Frankenstein and at 11.25, Dracula. Double Bill Seasons from 1975 to 1983. They missed 1982 out, so there's eight of them. And what I'll do is I'll rate them. Will the first film be better than the second film? So if you see me movie franchise battles, you'll know that I'll give each one a point. I've always thought that the second film's always better than the first film, that's why they kept it on later. So it'll be fun deciding, uh, seeing if that's true or not. My favourite season was the 1977 one, Dracula, Frankenstein and Friends, because it got us into horror films. So the 1975 one was the first one. It was called Midnight Movie Fantastic. So they did 12 films over six weeks. The first film was The Cabinet of Dr. Caligari from 1919 versus Quatermass 2 from 1957. So The Cabinet of Dr. Caligari it's a great film, it's a German film, expressionistic film. It's pretty good, I've seen it. I saw it at the cinema actually when I was at university. Pretty uh, decent, but uh, the trouble with me is I'm not too keen of silent films. They're all right. I, I, I quite like um, The Phantom of the Opera and Nosferatu, but I do prefer talkies. So comparing this to Quatermass 2, which is a Hammer film, it's the, the second of the Quater Mass films. I actually think it's better than the Quater Mass experiment. I thought it was like a darker film. So out of these two films, I'm going to give it to Quater Mass 2. So that's the first film zero, or the second film one. And these two films, there didn't seem to be much of a theme. Because usually these double bills is sometimes like a theme that connects both the films. The only theme I can think of with this is both films are in black and white. However, the second week were two Edgar Allan Poe based films. There were The Telltale Heart from 1960 and The Premature Burial from 1962. I haven't seen The Telltale Heart so I can't really um, rate it any. But The Premature Burial I thought it was excellent. I love the Edgar Allan Poe films that um, American International did. All of them have Vincent Price in apart from this one. It's got Ray Millard. But I thought he was excellent. Excellent in this film. He's fear of being buried alive. I've got to give it to The Premature Burial. The scores are the first film's zero, the second film's two. The third week was a weird one. It was like two historical sort of films. There were Noah's Ark from 1928 and Man and His Mate from 1940. I haven't seen any of these two films. No, Noah's Ark from 1928, it's a strange one. It's like a hybrid. It's sort of... A mixture between a silent film and a talkies film. Most of it's silent, but so, there's some parts that use um, dialogue because we're just discovering sound at this point. I haven't seen it, but th that sounds interesting. Man and His Mate from 1940, that's like um, a caveman sort of film, and it's got Lon Chani Jr. in, so that'd be interesting. I think out of these two films, I'll give it to the 1940s film, Man and His Mate. Once again, I'm not too keen of, sort of like silent films. Noah's Ark, uh, it shouldn't have really have been in a, a horror season so that's the first film zero the second film three the fourth week's an interesting one because it's sci-fi the first film's this island earth from 1955 and the second film's barbarella from 1968 so this island earth i've seen both these films this island earth's a pretty good one it's got some decent special effects as well 
I, I really enjoyed watching it. However, Barbarella, it, it, it's got Jane Fonda in, and there's that famous strip tease at the beginning. It's a really fun film. It's uh, like comedy. I've got to give it to Barbarella. That's the first film zero, the second film four. So the second film's way out in front. The fifth week, it was horror comedy. So uh, that was an interesting theme. The first film was The Cat and the Canary from 1939. And the second film, Comedy of Terrors from 1963. So Cat and the Canary, I haven't seen it. But um, it's supposed to be pretty good. Black and white. Bob Hope's in it. <laughs> So it probably is a good film. Comedy of Terrors has an excellent cast. It's got Vincent Price, Peter Lorre, Basil Rathbone, Boris Karloff. It's a really good laugh about Undertakers. It's American International Picture again. And then films have like a weird look to them like a scary surreal nightmarish look to them so I, I really like american international pictures easily this film wins so that's the first film zero the second film five so it, it sort of proven me point that the second film's usually the best one final week had the beast with five fingers from 1947 and the film called the mares from 1954 these films don't have a theme. The Beast with Five Fingers has Peter Lorre in one of his best performances. It's quite a creepy film with a hand crawling about. So I thought that was really good. It's a long time since I've seen it, but I really enjoyed watching it. The Mears is a 1953 film made in 3D and it's about this guy who inherits a castle and there's a hedge mares outside. So I don't think The Mears will be a very good film. I haven't seen it but it doesn't sound very good. But The Beast with Five Fingers, I remember it being really good. One of those uh, creepy films. So uh, finally the first film's better than the second film. So yeah! that's one to the first film and five to the second film. So this first season, the second film won. This first season's probably the weakest of the BBC double bills. But it was popular enough to continue the, the seasons yearly. So I hope you enjoyed the first season. And next time I'll be reviewing 1976. Masters of Terror. I'll see you next time. Bye everyone. Bye. Bye. Well, there'll be another horror double bill next Saturday evening when the beast from 20,000 Fathoms puts in an appearance and a scientific accident produces the Night of the Lepus. That's the horror double bill next Saturday evening starting at 10.35.